Dom here from Essential RC out on a really windy day. It's the story of the summer, I would say, in 2023. We're having a very windy summer, which is a bit unfortunate, but not in terms of demonstrating some of the uh, really nice uh, radio controlled aircraft that we get from our sponsors. Sam is on a video today. Thanks, Sam. Um, so what we've got here is the new Volantex RC Mini P47 Thunderbolt. I think there's uh, been quite a few in the Mini Warbird series over the years, my friends at Banggood. But this is the P47, we've had a P51, we've had a T28 Trojan, we've had an F4U Corsair, we've had several other things as well, but this is the P47. Really nice scheme. We even get a pilot in the cockpit, which is a must when you get a Warbird, but it's a really nice scheme. It does come with fixed landing gear, um, which we're not attaching because we're running off grass here and I'm just going to hand launch it. But if you are lucky enough to fly from somewhere that has an asphalt or tarmac or hard land takeoff landing strip, then by all means attach them. But I don't like them personally because they're not retractable and they look, it looks a bit ugly when you're flying along with your wheels dangling down. That aside, this has uh, a gyro stabilization system, which we can demonstrate really nicely on a windy day like today. Sam will show you on the windsock, it is blowing about 25 miles an hour wind today. That is why we are the only club members that are down here today. Nobody is mad enough to come out and fly today because they don't want to risk their precious radio controlled model aircraft. We don't mind because this is so durable and bounceable and we, I've no doubt we're going to show you that in a minute. So there are three modes on the transmitter, beginner, mid and expert. As you know, we've seen on a lot of other uh, warbirds like this. Uh, mid mode will not allow you to roll or loop to inverted. And it uses the stabilization system, as you can see it working there on the ailerons, to cancel out the gusts and the turbulence and to try and keep you level. In uh, beginner mode, it will give you less bank and pitch angle. Um, it certainly won't let you roll or pitch to inverted. But if you do want to do aerobatics, you can use the aerobatics button. You click that, it beeps, and then you put in a stick movement on that, um, on the right stick, <laughs> on the right stick, and that will do a roll or a, ro a loop the loop for you. Um, so that's fantastic. Um, so I know, let's chuck it in the air. Let's see how it flies on the, uh, hor the horrible wind that we've got today. I think it will fly quite well. Here we go. Come on, Sam, let's go out to the flight line. I'll put that down there. Make sure the box doesn't blow away. Shouldn't do if it's on the ground. Doesn't need much of a throw to get it in the air. This is a mode two transmitter, which means that the throttle and the rudder are on the left stick and the roll or aileron is on the right stick and up and down for pitch or with the elevator. So here we go. I'm going to put it in mid mode to start off with. Expert mode you, is really, really sensitive on the stick. I don't even use that myself. I just stick to mid mode. Here we go. Woo, blow the wind. Away, we're flying backwards. All right, here we go. Full power. Woo! So really fast downwind, obviously. And that's half power. Power, it will it will pull away quite nicely, but I'm using rudder and aileron to turn. Woo! So I'm just going to try and bring it close for uh, Sam to get some nice close up. Do that again for you, Sam. Yeah, it's difficult when the wind is so jumpy. Yeah, don't zoom in too much. That's the trick. Shouldn't need to zoom in at all. 
when uh, when I'm this close. There you go. Expert level flying now. Thank you. Well, it's mate, it's this gyro system. It's making me look good. So what I can do, I'm going to do uh, one more slow pass for the camera. over your head so you get very disorientated. We'll try that again. So click. It does it all by itself. So you click that button and then a, a stick movement with the right stick over to the right and it does that. We'll try it the other way. And again, it also do a loop, but I have to pull back on the stick. Here we go. Oh, whoa, oh my God, no. Kind of, I didn't have enough power. We'll bring it back. Here we go. There we go. You have to have kind of three quarters power to do that. And again. There we go. And one, one more. more time. Get it this time, Sam. Oh no, come on. Bring it back. <laughs> do a loop! <laughs> I tell you to do a loop, do a loop! <laughs> Yay! Playing with the wind. You can't get away from it. You learn a lot by flying with the wind. Whoa, I'm down. <coughs> so as I said earlier, <coughs> the great thing with these is very hard to damage them, especially if you're flying off grass, which is great if you have never flown RC before. And these don't cost a lot of money. Um, but the, the one thing you will do is knock the propeller off, but it's designed for that to happen. All you have to do is get the shaft of the motor in that little hole in the propeller and pop it back on. And then you're ready to go again. Simple as that. Here we go. with these batteries, it's incredible.
advanced pilots out there as well, it really teaches you how to use rudder and aileron. You can't get away, you know, if you want to make some really tight turns, you have to use rudder. <laughs> Killing the cameraman. Sorry, <laughs> No damage, fantastic. It does make me wonder why I spend so money on a, you know bigger, more expensive stuff because honestly, if you get one of these, you will just have so much fun. You don't have to get this this um, a P47. There, there's even you know there's a Spitfire as well. There are se there are several. So you the link for this is in the video description and the pinned comment. But um, look at the, the whole series and, and pick which, uh, which, you, which you prefer based on its looks. They all fly pretty much the same. They all have the modes, the, aer the, aer the uh, aerobatics button and do the same thing and are as much fun to fly. So thanks for watching this episode of Essential RC. We have so much fun down here on the mega windy days when nobody else is down here because you can have so much fun like this. Thanks to Sam on camera. And we'll be back soon on Essential RC. Bye.